Hey, what's happening guys? Zook Wayne here. Hope you guys are having a good day. And as always, remember, high hopes and uh, low expectations. I'm going to start this video off by saying this is not my um, my original plan. Don't worry, I'm not running short on these videos. I have news slash speculation videos. I have like four or five planned at least. I'm going to talk about Batman Arkham 2020 slash, uh, slash Gotham Knights, whatever you want to call it, and the Suicide Squad game. Uh, to death, you're gonna you're gonna hear a lot about it the next couple of weeks. But honestly, today I just didn't, didn't really feel like recording a video, so I wasn't gonna make a video today. But if this popped up, I'm like, this is a nice, fun video I can just do in a few minutes. Uh, so please like and subscribe if you want to see uh, more updates on those games. But for now, we're gonna talk about this because I'm sure there's a few people in my audience that would like to hear this and they haven't already figured it out yet. Uh, but you know. Uh, Michael Keaton is obviously in talks, this is a rumor, of course, to return as Batman, which is uh, very exciting news. If you're on Twitter at all today, then you saw this everywhere. But uh, yes, The Flash is getting a movie. I can't remember when they announced They announced that like way back in 2016 or something, but it's been delayed over and over again. It's almost a meme at this point. But apparently it's finally picking up steam, and uh, I guess Ezra Miller isn't fired or canceled for that video that he had a couple of months back. You know, you know, but uh, yeah, that's basically the news of this article. If you, I'll link in the description if you want more detail on it. But it's just a lot of fluff. It basically just says that it's rumored uh, by reliable sources that uh, he will return. And although Keaton said that he uh, wouldn't return um, unless it was directed by Tim Burton, it looks like he changed his mind. Uh, this is great news, honestly. It looks like The Flash is going to be a multiverse movie. It's not going to be a solo Flash. Oh, it is going to be a solo Flash movie. But it's going to be like Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse, except with other superheroes. It's what it looks like, which is a little disappointing to me as a Flash fan, because I really wanted to see some uh, Ezra Miller. I kind of liked him as a Flash, to be honest. But this is, I mean, this is exciting. I like it. And if you remember in my Snyder Cut video, if you watched that when the Snyder Cut was announced, I said that it would be really confusing if we had all these universes going on at once with Joker, with the, the Batman, with the DCEU, and now the Snyder Cut DCEU. So I said it's a possibility that uh, the DCEU could try to revive itself and to reset everything into a Flashpoint movie. They're going to try to do a Flashpoint movie. And I said the Flash movie's coming out, so that's possible. And it looks like they could do it. It's not exactly Flashpoint. You know, we're. Uh, I don't know why I'm doing that, but we're at, it, it's going to be like a multiverse, I guess, not exactly changing the timeline, or maybe it will be, I don't know. But this is um, this is pretty exciting, I know a lot of people are Keaton fans, a lot of people are Flash fans, uh, hope we get to see, and, you know, I'm just really excited we're going to see uh, Keaton again, and um, by the way, uh, rest in peace, Joel, uh, you know, I mean, that's, I know a lot of people, this is actually kind of difficult for me to talk about, which I find funny, a lot of people think that, um, he ruined uh, the character Batman. A lot of people think he didn't have a good take, which, I mean, yeah, I, I'm not going to say I disagree with that. But to be honest, you know, Batman and Robin, uh, that, I mean, that, yeah, that, that gave me a childhood. I got to be honest, just, you know, the, as ridiculous as Mr. Freeze, Poison Ivy, and Bane were, I mean, it was amazing seeing them on the big screen for the first time as a kid. I thought it was amazing. So, rest in peace. And uh, that's going to do it for today's video. Uh, what do you guys think? Are you happy to see Keaton back? Do you hate it? Let me know in the comments below. I try to respond to every comment. Uh, like if you enjoyed. If you made it this far, then you obviously did. So please like and uh, subscribe if you really enjoyed. If you want to see daily updates on the DC comic book video games. And uh, stay awesome, y'all. And peace.